Alright, what is good, what is gravy? I just did an entire video on how to do it. I felt like that was going to be too long and I wanted it to be quick and simple on how to do pack a bunch. Let's go ahead and get out of this. I do have everything already done. So what you're going to have to do is you're basically going to have to fight your way through everything. I'm going to run around the map, do a lot of running and a lot of looking too because you have to make sure that you have the right ones. But what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to summon your champions, which are, you know, this is going to highlight, oh shit, over like this, you have the god Dano. There's four gods, you're going to see them on your screen, Dano, Ra, Zeus, and Odin. And you have to kill each and every other champions, and how you do that is just summon this. It's going to summon up a champion, he's going to be like a little mini boss, you kill him, a little icon is going to pop up, everybody's going to have it. Lucky thing about Dano is you come over and you have Ra, you can see Ra right there. I've already done this all, it's taken forever. But here's his dong. You have to summon each of them. You can't just hit the perk, you have to get the uh the dong. Run down here. You don't really have to open up every door to do it, thankfully, but it does help to get you around the map. It's a really small map. Nine is really fun too. You're gonna run to the raw towers, just keep running around. You're gonna go towards the collapsed tunnels. Keep an eye. This is your fallen hero. It's usually always there. I haven't had a game where it's not there. You go through the pit, which is basically like the death barrier. The fucking zombie died. Oh my god. Okay, whatever. You run through the Odin tunnel. And this door is not gonna be open until you uh you get to it. But we'll get to that later. Okay, Tiger Run, I can do it. But you're gonna go. I miss a step. Oh, it's Gladiator Run. I, I can't deal with that. So you're gonna go this way. This is your flooded crypt. And you're gonna see your temple. And this way. If you even just have one, this is still gonna show up. You hit this four spikes are going to appear from the ground and you have to put in each four of their heads now I only showed you where Dano, Ra and Zeus are we're gonna get to uh... or no, Dano and Ra, we're gonna get to Zeus and Odin but uh, once you summon that temple you have to do, you have to kill four champions I suggest killing them all four before you started that way all you medically have to do is just summon it it's gonna take a minute to drop the spikes but it's not a big issue, don't worry too much about that. And I mean, this map has a lot of running. Like, half the time I get lost because I circle around it. I think I just, like, I think I just did right now. Let's yeah, see, I usually forget to go up here. This is the temple. You're going to see that. How many of these? Is it just two? I thought it was more. Oh, well in that case. Bob Hollow for the win. Good shit. But it's pretty much it though. Um, finding the four um, perks isn't really that hard. I did want to do a location on all of them, but I couldn't do that. And you can also change those in the uh, item class if you didn't know that. But this shrine should have been right, I think. Actually, yeah. But if you look into it, you can see the heavens, which is really cool. It is 5,000 standard, which isn't bad. I need to get these special ones killed. Oh, that's a duck. Okay, well I ended up dying anyways. But uh, that's how you pack a bunch. You have to kill all four of the champions. Collect all the perks just to even activate the shrine. I believe that's how I did it. I didn't activate it prior because I didn't find it. But the first pack of punch is at 500. The second one is at 250. However, you do not get ammo. So don't pack a punch thinking you're going to get ammo and get mad. You're going to get shit out of luck and not get ammo. Which is perfectly fine. It's not a hard map to play. Don't get me wrong. I think nine is supposed to be like your standard new mechanic map. 
and then you have Voyage of Despair, which is just... We need to learn how to play that better before I start playing that, because I played it earlier and I fucking hated it. But that's going to wrap it up for this video. I hope you liked it. Please leave a comment if you want me to do any more zombies. I do love doing zombie videos. They are so much fun. I love playing zombies. I'm not your best zombie player, but I am your average. Let's hop in and kill some shit. I do focus mainly on multiplayer when it comes to Call of Duty, but zombies is more of a more of a fun aspect when I don't feel like sweating my ass off. This game just came out today, and I do hope to make a video on the multiplayer soon. I do want to do a blackout video, and I also want to do something for multiplayer, like I said. Maybe like a sniping video where, I, you know, I pop off. I mean, I'm not no sniper. I don't get clips. That's not something, I, you know. I haven't gone for in a long time but I'm rambling on zombies is a lot of fun let me know if you want to see some more zombies go ahead and hit, hit that sub button if you're not subbed already and leave a like and comment please that would be greatly appreciated I love hearing back from people I love making people enjoy watching videos if you don't enjoy it then it is what it is we all had a nice day did it deuces